Hello, 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 my Sagittarius's. How are you doing, my optimistic, majestical, spiritual Sagittarians? Welcome to the Black Queen Prophetess channel, where I do weekly reads using cardamancy and tarot readings. I will be doing a nine card spread with uh, the Cosmopolitan deck of Cardamancy and then a one card uh, Major Arcana pull from the Black Tarot deck. Now, Sagittarius, let's start off your reading with a prayer. Holy Spirit, you are welcome in this place to move and be and speak through me. I yield my body, my mind, my, my mouth, my vocal cords, the air I breathe to you, Holy Spirit, to give me the message for me to receive and convey the message you have for Sagittarius for the week of April 11th through April 18th. Mm-hmm. I thank you, Holy Spirit, for the message. I thank you, Heavenly Father, for a discerning and wisdom so that I might rightly divide the message to Sagittarius. All right. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Now, as I said in my last video that I recorded, last reading with Libra, is that um, don't limit it to just the weeks. I, I do the week so that I can keep track of when I did the readings. Um, but this reading can apply to you if you're watching this on May. Okay. Okay. Also, you may notice that I upload the videos throughout the week that I'm reading for. That, too, understand that that is when it, you know, I, I do more than just readings. I don't even get paid. I'm doing this for the pure joy of uh, letting you all know, I'm not, I'm not uh, making any money off of my readings right now. Um, this is purely for, um, to be honestly, practice. You know, um, getting good at it, um, reading this, and I get a joy out of you know, giving you the message, being used by the Holy Spirit to give uh, some of you a message in time so that you can make um, informed decisions here. Okay, Aquarius, I mean Sagittarius. I was talking. So this reading, it, it depends on when you're seeing. If you're watching this in June, this is when the Holy Spirit or God has to say what you have to say here. Okay. Now, I do my readings and I post them based off of how many likes and views I get from that specific zodiac sign. In this past week, you've given some um, good views here, Sagittarius, last week. So that's why you're in my top 10, uh, well, not top 10. Well, you didn't quite make the top five, Sagittarius, so that's why you're being read now. So, a little information on how I, I do my readings and post them. I do it based off of, one, if it's your season. You're going to be the first one that I do the, the weekly reads for. While we're in the season of Aries, Aries is always going to be done first and posted first and then the most views and like videos will be after aries
And this week, Taurus was the most views. I believe I got like seven or eight views and a like from that view. And then next was, uh, let's see, was Virgo, who was the next one, and then Libra. Actually, Sagittarius, you are a part of my top five. So you did, uh, uh, you watch my videos, and I appreciate your videos. And the way I show my video, I mean, I show my appreciation is you are in the top five that I do for the week and post. So if you want to get a high, get posted, read first, in the first five, then you want to continue viewing and or liking it. Share my videos with other Sagittarians. And let's get your numbers up on on the readings. Then you'll be second until it's your season in, in December and January. Okay? Oh, I'm sorry. November and January. I'm thinking about Capricorn. Okay? So if you want to stay in the top five, continue watching. Share my videos. Leave a comment if you have some um, comments here. So... Let's get into your reading, what the Holy Spirit has to say for you. And we're going to be talking about um, your work responsibility. You uh, may be getting um, some more work responsibility here. Um, maybe you'll be getting a, a small promotion at your job for some of you. <coughs> you may be reading up on something. How to do something, uh, a self-help book, you may be reading that. Um, but for those who are working for someone, you are being handed more responsibility. Doesn't mean that you have a lot of work. Just means that you're going to be responsible for more. Okay, is it responsible getting it done? Or you may be responsible, you may get some responsibility with some assistance here. So we're definitely going to be talking about either your workplace or um, yeah, the Holy Spirit is saying this is uh, work responsibility. Definitely we're going to be talking about your work responsibility. And you may have to read up or train on it. Okay. Now, you have this three of club, which also means that you're going to have an increase in work. So, as much as that doesn't mean that you're going to have more work. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. You, you're going to have more work. You're going to be responsible for more, and you're, you're going to, your work is going to increase. And this may be a problem for you. This is going to more work, more problems. <laughs> it is going to be a challenge to get all the work done that you need to get done at your job now. But you will be getting more money. We have two cards that is, um, yes, yes, you, you got, um, Three money cards here where you're going to have a small increase in your money here. And there is also another small raise. So you're definitely going to get a raise for the work that you're going to do. It is going to be challenging for you to do it. But the money that they're giving you isn't 
I feel like the money that they're giving you isn't matching the responsibility and the work increase that you're going to be getting. You may already have a lot on your plate. And I feel like, <laughs> um, and I'm not really laughing at you, Sagittarius. I feel like you have a problem with a manager, a female manager, um, with this queen of spades here. You have a problematic manager here. female manager and she just don't like you hell she was going to give you more responsibility without the raise but if it wasn't for this king of hearts it's like we cannot give her that extra work and not give her a raise that's not happening you have found favor with the king who is in this fact over them? So you may have a supervisor or manager that is a woman that don't like you. And she wants to give you all the stuff that she doesn't want to do. She didn't want to give you a raise, Sagittarius. But this king did. And that's the only reason why you got that little bit of raise. That's the only reason you got that little bit of raise. And don't go out there and just spend it, spend that money on something. Um, actually, it must have been some type of a significant raise because you're going out and you're spending money. You're going shopping now that you have this extra money. Mm-hmm. And I see that you're going to probably have a change in managers here. The outcome card here. So this is the subject. This is the outcome. The outcome is though it's going to be a challenge, you're going to, you're going to achieve what you need to do, honey. Okay. This manager is leaving and you're going to be replaced you're going to get a new manager a new work you're going to get a new manager you're going to get a new manager They're letting her go. That's why you're getting more responsibility for now. Because they're giving you the responsibility of some of the responsibility that the manager would have to take on while they're onboarding this new manager. Hmm. For some of you, Sagittarius, you are the new manager. That's why you're getting more work because you're taking this problematic person or what the job. They about to lose their job and you're about to take it. Mm-hmm. So some of you, you're getting more responsibility because of this manager. This king, this manager is going to be leaving. I don't know whether well, my spirit is she's being replaced. Okay. With a new manager, more fair manager, a good leader. Mm hmm. And in some cases, um, Sagittarius, you we are replacing this problematic. That's why you got more work. And it's because of this king here is the reason why you got your money. It may it may also be because of this king, the reason why you got the managerial job. 
while you replace it. Say, give it to Sagittarius. Give her more money and get rid of this person. She's leaving. She's a whole problem. This um, three of uh, spades, the Holy Spirit reminds me, is also third party interference. So this manager was a third party for some of you. Um, you were getting a raise. You're working with this. She, th this king is above this queen in your workplace. So if she's your manager. This is the owner, or this is the. Uh, um, she's an assistant manager. He's the manager. Okay, and you was working with him to get it, but she was trying to stop it. Okay. And all it did was got her without a job. Okay. Now, let's do the one card. Um, Major Arcana Pull from the Black Tarot Deck by Nisha Williams. Now, Chad. Okay. I'm going to try to make this quick because I know Sagittarius. Y'all don't like nothing too long, child. The fact that I didn't went almost... Uh, over 15 minutes. Is a lot for you. I try to keep these under 25. But for some reason I always. Seem to. Uh, go long with Libra. And I think every reader. That's on here on the YouTube. Has. A specific Zodiac sign. That they kind of really get into their readings and it seems to me or at least li lately has been Libra okay Sagittarius the world card it traits is the result rebel yes this is a woman watering the world card I mean world knowing the importance of looking after the planet and honoring the living the things in the world the world card indicates the, oh, wait a minute, hold on. That was horrible. Let me start over. I'm just going to say my description of it, and then I'm going to tell you what it means when this card is pulled, Sagittarius. Um, And what it represents in the yang, because it came out in the yang, your alignment and affirmation. So, this is a card, just looking at it, um, she's, she's watering the world. And she knows the importance of uh, tilling or tending to uh, the world um, and all living things. In honoring it okay um, when the world card is pulled these are the things that you should be considering one sorry, are you liberated are you safe grounded and whole two how do you show up in the world and three how can you heal the world the flower is a daisy or a daffodil, which represents new beginnings. Uh, the element is earth, the chakra is root. In the yang, it indicates integration, sense of belonging, travel. Oh, that is so perfect for you, Sagittarius, because I know you, Sagittarius, love you some travel, child. Um, accomplishment, completion. Achievement and the wholeness. To stay aligned is exercise. Practice grounding yourself. And your affirmation for this week is I breathe in and embody inner peace. Embracing the calm of being connected with the universe in mind, body, and soul. And I would say not necessarily universe, but being one with God. I you know, I understand universe and all of that, but I am a Christian first. And I know some of you religious people is going to be like, you can't be, 
You can't be calling yourself a Christian and read tarot. I, I just did. I just did. And I know I just offended a couple of Sagittarians, so I guess y'all not going to be in the top five. Okay. But I just did. And the reason why I say I, I may have offended you Sagittarians is because you Sagittarians tend to be very religious. So, yes, I didn't make you feel good that I said that I was a Christian and I'm reading tarot unless you are a tarot reader and you proclaim Christian. But you ain't saying it in the same breath as saying that you are a cardamancer or a tarot reader. But I, I am telling you that I subscribe to God. When it says universe, it is God to me, Okay. That's why I don't just call out to spirit for a message. I call out to the Holy Spirit because that's the only one I'm going to hear anyway. <laughs> but yes, this is perfect for you. Um, you have um, the world card also. It, 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 think about the world. It is a circle. It is a cycle. The world goes through cycles. Moon cycles, sun cycles, yearly cycles. You know what I'm saying? monthly cycles and it's the beginning of something new which would be this new position that you're holding at your job and you you may be also traveling taking a short journey too because these clubs that's in your um reading also represents travel or movement or going somewhere but i'm thinking it's more in your workplace if you don't have a workplace, it's your business. Your business is increasing. Someone was trying to hate, but you got someone that came in and helped you out. All right? So that's all I have for you, Sagittarius. I ended it three minutes and 26 seconds before the 25 minutes, so I'm doing better. Anyway, I will see you next week for your weekly read, Sagittarius. Bye.